Team Mayor. Looks like we're gonna jump right the fuck in it right now. I mean, that's my language. <laughs> Uh, it's that's unnecessary, but let's just freeze out. I'm just freeze out. I'm just pretty excited for this. Um, you know, hey, do you guys want to let all the people playing know that this is our grand final set one? Maybe they want to. Maybe they want to watch. Or, we'll uh, we'll do it. Grand finals of 64 double set one beginning now. Go home, nobody liked you. Kiro doesn't like teams, so he boos. He know why, he know why he doesn't like teams? Because he doesn't play teams. Because he can't, he can't have soft focus and focus on two things, two things at the same time. Can't multitask. Can't multitask. You know what Kiro means? Single task. You know what uh, bad, multitaskers, bad multitaskers are also bad at? Love making. Sucks to be Kira. <laughs> <laughs> and that's may maybe not true at all, but I just felt like saying that. No, I hear Kira's actual stun ups. <laughs> From all the online ladies. When I say all the online ladies, I mean none of them. Yeah, so we can actually be kind of on This is an unofficial stream, so if we're allowed to get a little raunchy here, right? So, grab the volume a little bit. Yeah. Not at all. All right, here we go. Season 7 raunchy. Oh, so I believe they're changing the stages. Yeah. Now the stage will work in Grand Finals. Time at what point are you? So, we have Tacos, Port 1, Port 2, the Z, uh, Jaime in Port 3, and Super Boom in Port 4. Jaime going old school Mario. Super Broom fan, because they're going to look for the sweep here. <laughs> that is so clever. <laughs> Jaime missing the down air, but catches the down air. Oh, wow. Takes a beautiful play. That was yeah. a good trade. I mean, not this not really necessary because Falcon was dead anyway, but it was going to try and help his recovery anyway. Yeah. Mario's on the up air by high main. Oh, and Tacos actually sends Mario the other way to kind of give uh, the Z a chance to survive. Another. Oh, Tacos has to be careful trying to take on Boom by himself. This is going to be a stock. Quick stock by Boom and Jaime. Oh, wow. Another that one possibly. I don't know that the potential to save him, but it worked. Oh, wow. Boom coming down. Boom going deep for that one. Is he going to come back to save his partner? Nope. These stocks are just going really quick, but yeah. I mean, you don't want to get off the stage against this Pikachu. Because he's going to do work on him. And that's going to be it for him wow. right there. That was a great freaking give from... Uh, Crazy as well. Yeah, crazy as well. I wish my thought would be a hedge guard on like that. This is a high level right on the stock. Oh, wow. Look at them all. I mean, you go off the edge to edge guard. Wow, great DI. Did you see how high he went through that down? That it drill? insane. It didn't pay off at the end, boy. It was still pretty to watch. Yeah. The Z manages to not get gimped by Pikachu there. Jumps right out of the jab combo. Gets put by neutral. So this is a matchup by. Oh wow! He stays just out of range. Oh. Catches high man with drill. Boom! Still with four stops. Yeah, I couldn't even see that because of the corner of the TV. I mean, that's really important. Yeah. And uh, Falcon just takes the stock from Kirby. Probably his last. Yeah. Let's see this is a very quick match. That's gonna be it. And he just takes the easy way out. So they take game one. Very quickly, wow. So, basically, I think what we saw there was a lot of risk taking, and, and when you fly off the stage to edge guard, every player on this console right now is at that level where you're not getting back yet. So, to be honest, I don't think we saw enough risk taking. I don't think we saw enough. <laughs> I don't know. How long was that match? <laughs> maybe tops two minutes. Definitely a lot shorter. Oh, I don't know. I mean, maybe, so maybe in the less than four minutes for sure. It's longer than Kiro's Love Lake, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Shot fired! That's fired. That's awesome. <laughs> boom, boom. Uh, so, it's all the back, all back. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Kiro's gonna, I hope Kiro watches this later. <laughs> Actually, you know what? He won't, because it seems. So, it's like, who's Mr. Clean, clean over here talking shit to me? Why don't you shave your head? Uh, funny story about that. A couple of years ago, my hair fell off. Ah, uh, okay, so you shaved <laughs> your hair. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I love this shit, man. You wake up in the summer, 
Yeah, you your hair's ready. You go to sleep, your hair's ready. There you go. What are you shaving in the shower? Yeah. Shaving in the shower. So I got an hour. I got the urge. <laughs> Alright, so we got some character switches here. Now, how important is Galen Madu? Oh, so check it out. Z is going Pikachu, and Tacos is going Falcon. So they're going to kind of mix up different style on, on them, so we'll see if the adjustment does anything. Wow, look at Jaime. Oh, he gets edged by Falcon. Falcon. Yeah, he was going after Pikachu hard, though, and pretty effectively, but you know that's where that soft focus comes in. You have to see what else is going on on the stage, even while you're off of it. Oh, oh wow, it would have been something. Yeah, they're going really aggressive. Yeah, they really are. Yeah. And look, Boom's going to take advantage of Pikachu flying off the stage like that. But still, he still hasn't landed. Like, so Pikachu, he still hasn't landed. Uh, since he flew off the stage. Still has not landed since he flew off the stage for the edge guard on Mario like 30 seconds ago. Ooh, that was a bad. That was a really good edge hog. Oh, wow. And Boom looks to take advantage of that own team hit. Wow. These guys all have incredible DI. Insane. Oh, he, you know what? If he went for the edge, he would have gotten hit by that uh, dash attack. Yep. So Tacos is Captain Falcon right now? Is Tacos is Falcon? Falcon, yeah. It looks somewhat similar uh, to the untrained eye because they, they both play such a flashy uh, Falcon. Yeah. He's not getting back there. These matches are just going like that. Oh, yeah. And I feel like that's how Dream Life works regardless because it's so, such a compact stage. Yeah, exactly. Like, there's really no separation besides at this point right now. Right. That was a great edge bar from Boom. Just takes the stock right there again. You see, yeah, it took him so far off the stage. But this is still anybody's like, game right here. I have a try to go for the back. Great, great edge hog. Oh, and Falcon makes it back. I didn't expect Tacos to make it back from that. Oh, man. Oh. And you know what? Jaime does a good job of at least holding Falcon off long enough to let Boom recover. Yep. Oh, that's not going to be good. So that own team hit sends Falcon right in position to get hit by Boom's Pikachu. Arma is a bit. So you just got to be careful not to hit uh, Tacos. Uh, and they're both looking for the edge guard on Marion. That out. was the most impressive edge guard I've seen. What a turnaround right there. What an edge guard. That was the best team edge guard I've found. Oh before. my god! If Falcon misses the up B, but Pikachu's quick attack flies into it. That was crazy. I'm gonna watch that on the street though. I totally missed it. Oh, dude, he was on the right side of the stage. That's why I came to the right side of the stage. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, the dog on the Falcon. But it says, oh, no jump without me. It's going to be too little, too late. He was finishing that stock. Just like that. You let someone else, leave someone alone for, for, for just a second. And it's, yeah. Ooh, just watching his own partner get decimated right there. But it's Mario, who we'll come back. And they play game two. So yeah. he overextended him. I mean, it's not like he really had many options, but he extended himself so far to get Mario. You're not going to. I mean, you can be tricky, but you got to stay on the stage. You can't fly that far off the stage when Boom's on the stage waiting for your turn. Oh, Garrett is changing his back. I believe uh, Tacos is Yoshi. Tacos is a nasty Yoshi, and he has a nasty Fox, so let's see what happens here. Wow, the only thing I'd be worried about being Fox around that Pikachu and that Mario. I would say the problems are going to the stage, but that's just me. Especially with the Fox in the game. These guys love this Just stand. like that. Yeah, I agree with you completely. And they both moved up the stock really quick. I think it's just a nerve right now. This could be the last match of the, uh, of the doubles tournament here. I hate to say it, but I think it's from Bridge to Pick in. Wow, great recovery by Fox there. It's such a shame when you get recoveries like that if he gets hit right back on the stage. Yeah. Look at this. Shield pressure. Oh, wow, he managed to get back against Jaime and Mario. Great off smash by the feet. Oh, and he runs into that shine. I don't know if that was the best option there. Oh, watch out. When you're edge guarding, like Fox edge guarding Mario there, you really gotta be aware of Pikachu. That's like, you have Boom flying in on you, you can't just like go for that edge guard. Your stock is always has to be worth more than the stock you're gonna take, you know? Yeah. Tell you that, see right there, he was so aggro. That's a singles mindset, in my, in my opinion, playing doubles, you know? Yeah. That's something you normally don't want to do in singles, let alone in doubles. 
Well, singles, you know you can fly off stage as far as you want if you're going to get the kill because you're going to come back. Unless it's Jigglypuff and a rest combo, you can't, you know, you're not going to recover in time. See, look at that, look at that camera. Beautiful. That's the one thing Mario has to fuck every time. Yeah, that's fine. But in doubles, you can't, you can't fly off the stage for a, for a life, you know, take a life in a combo that's just going to cost you a life as well. To be fair, you can't really fall off the stage against two more high people play for it just as barely. Singles or doubles. I mean, you really don't want to fall off the stage against Taco and Z either. Yes, well, he's lucky that the back of that up air hit Pikachu and he wasn't back on off the stage. This is still a ugly game. If they could take out Pikachu's stock right here, they think I'd put down two stocks. You know, it, it's, it is close, but they're much more giftable than Mario and Pikachu. Yeah. Just that box is so bad. So, Tom is the real people in the blue box? Yes. Yeah, Alright, let's see if we can get out. Wow! If we can get out of there, it doesn't get hit by that fast fell forward air. Wow, and he tries that slow, slow drop in neutral air. So clever. Oh. Oh. Tago saved the Z for a moment after oh, we get an up smash. I guess it's not the moment that someone was already at the game before I first started to stop. Yeah, he, didn't, he still had that one. Oh, wow, and he gets that back air. What DI. Oh, he's Ooh. lucky that he. Oh my god. Tacos is taking so many risks off the edge for his goal. That's gonna cost him. Now he's gonna need to steal that stock. There's no stock to steal. Nope. So Tacos will have uh, one last chance to do some cool stuff with his Yoshi. <laughs> Are we gonna see a Wobble Pop in here? We might see some cool teammate horse stuff. Just eat that up there like it's nothing. That's still a pretty good DI. <laughs> uh, avoid all that. But, wow. all right. Great game, guys. Great game. All right, guys. That's your uh, grand finals for, for doubles. The champions, Super Boom Fan and Jaime, Team Mayhor, and the runner-up, Team the Tacos and the Z. All right, so this is Jimmy Joe and Dark Link. And we're uh, we're gonna hop off the commentary now, and uh, I think LA Smash. What are you, Soto? What are you guys gonna stream now? That's teams on stream right here. Jack, like anybody? Teams on stream. <laughs> Tune back in tomorrow for singles. Money back anybody.